Oh, welcome back on Sunday. Oh no, we've got a good a one person elevator. Oh hi, Garrison. For what? Oh, oh, what's going on? Excuse me. Yeah, who are you? Ah, uh, just kill him. Oi. Ariana tried to shoot me. So? Miranda's poisonous influence, no doubt. Yeah, right. I'm sorry she missed. Where's Kai Lang? Dead. I don't know. God. He took my research and left us here to die. Oh well. Miranda, can you hear me? One of us deserves it. Huh? <gasps> That's close enough. Both of you. Your own daughter. Kai Lang didn't finish the job, but I will. This ends here. Yeah, it On does. The now that the Reapers are taken care of. We have a way out. There are more of them, you know. Shepard, don't let him take her. It's not up to me. Shepard, please. I can be reasonable. No problem with you. I just want Oriana and the research data. Not Miranda, though. You want a lot. Yeah. You get your life in return. How much is that worth? Not that much, probably. Uh. All right. Oh. Take her. <laughs> but I want out alive. Oh! Oh! Kill him! <laughs> Ah, there you go. If you survive that, you can have your life. No deal. Ribbed nose. Did he hurt you? Are you all right? Hope so. I mean, I hope not. I mean, it's okay, yeah. Ori. You're safe now. And the blind forest. Oh, I just, I want to get out of here. We can't. We will. Give me a minute, okay? Right. I'm timing this. If it takes more than a minute. Commander Shepard. Oh, fancy meeting you. We got a break. You all right? I'll be fine. Really. I don't know how you managed it, but I'm grateful you're here. Well, you know, by being me, what happened anyway? How did you do all this? What? Finding my father didn't take long once I confirmed he worked for the elusive man. <sighs> Just had to follow the lies. Yeah. Once I saw what this place really was, I couldn't just walk away. Of course. Things yeah. got really complicated when Reapers showed up in Kai Lang. Even worse. You survived. Not many people He's can do a cheater. That. When you mentioned he was involved, I took a few precautions. Oh, yeah. Probably saved my life. What are they doing over there? Playing Doom. I could have helped. Miranda, this whole thing was a huge risk. You should have told me. Yeah. You have a water wind, Shepard. A water. This was my fight. It's been a long time coming. Right, it's been a minute now. You did it. It's over. Oh, it has been a minute. Yes. I just wish my sister didn't have to see all this. About your father. No, more than a minute. I'm glad he's gone, Shepard. So am I. I'm sorry if that sounds cold. No, it does, but no. whatever. I understand. A minute and a it's half. Over. More like. For both of us. You're well happy. We can stop running. Yes, you can. You weren't running in the first place. What's our status? We're standing there. We can use from this place? Research data is gone, but some basic facility information is still intact. Shuttle arrivals and oh. departures, Cerberus included. Sounds boring. No direct links, but it's a start. Grab anything you can off the computer. Oh. I'll take it back to be analyzed. Especially the porn. I can do better than that. Oh? What? You got it all there, Before have you? Before Kai Lang took off, I planted a tracer on him. Oh! If you act fast, You'll track him right to the elusive man. Nice one, big Trace. ass. Sounds like you thought of everything. Oh, yeah? Not quite, but... Nobody's perfect. <laughs> oh! Thanks, Miranda. Least of all this you. Exactly what we need. Cheers. Seriously, though, cheers. I thought you might need some good news. I want to kill that bastard. Yeah, right. What's next for you two? Get her someplace safe. And then die. Get the scratch cleaned up. What a scratch? Okay. I gotta follow all this up. I'll be in touch, Shepard. No. Soon. You better not be. I hope so. That might mean I have to find you. Worry. We've had enough of Father's hospitality. Somewhere stupid on the Citadel I'm again. Sure everyone knows about this place. You're always somewhere unexpected. Don't talk over her. I've had enough of this place. Yeah, I had enough of it long ago. As soon as the first banshee showed up, basically. 
Hi everyone. I wasn't in favor of your diversion <clears throat> sanctuary, Commander. You're everyone. Too many unknowns. Well, there wasn't anything else for me to do wrong. at the time. The Silver Slab you raided hinted at something big, but we never expected this. What? All those refugees, all that slaughter. Slaughter. Just to study indoctrination. Sanctuary did need to be shut down, sir. Yep. What they learned about the Reapers wasn't worth all those lives. Nope. It's useful intel, Commander, but you're right. The cost was too high. Well, we got it now, anyway. Do we have a location on the elusive man? Yes. We had a tracer on Kai Lang when he We didn't. Back. Miranda did. Good. That gives us a fighting chance to take Cerberus out of this war. Good. Agreed. We need to end Teleport. Cerberus and focus on the Reapers. My thoughts exactly. Hack it out. Bye. What are you out of? Can I buy you some, though? Because I want the dosh. Right. Well, 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 we've done a priority, so I guess I probably have to talk to everyone again. Or maybe I can't be asked anymore. Probably no one. They probably got forced. Oh. Well, I don't want to. Yeah. Oh! Just tell me you're going to take Cerberus down. Cerberus is already dead. They just don't know it yet. Well, and when their base is nothing but a smoking crater, which remember is. That you're the one who helped us find them. Oh, wait, no. Thanks. Sanctuary isn't their base. New article on Quarian Fleet. Read it. Oh, Turian. Read it. Yeah. Trout! Oh, what the hell? What was that? What was that little animation? Shepherd? You bloody... Ah, <sighs> whatever. Cerberus is gonna have a hard time recruiting now. Yeah. Oh. Nice work shutting that place down. Cheers. Is okay? I hope not. She will be. Even for Cerberus, that place was crazy. They've always been about the ends justifying the means. Yeah. But how do you do that to innocent people and tell yourself you're helping humanity? By being Cerberus. I don't know how the elusive man can stand looking at himself in the mirror. Probably doesn't look in a mirror. I've been wondering about that for a while with those freaky eyes. Just looks at the planet. Whatever he's thinking, he won't be thinking it for much longer. Oh. Damn right, Commander. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Shepard. If you have time, I discovered another example of human behavior oh. I do not quite oh. understand. I don't have time, but okay. Oh, let's go somewhere else and talk about it, apparently. No. What is it now? News from Earth. The Resistance snuck video cameras inside a Reaper containment camp. Oh! I find the images difficult to process. Show me. I bet it's pretty gruesome in there. Show me. I am not easily repulsed. Huh. But I expected the prisoners to adhere to a comprehensible hierarchy of needs. Hierarchy. Of societal norms and threatened with death. Not hierarchy. It's logical that their only priority be survival. They should have turned on each other and been uncompromisingly selfish. But not all were. Oh! Some prisoners were, what, nice to each other? The Reapers delayed the executions of prisoners who informed them about other prisoners' escape attempts. What's the point? The more attempts reported, the longer a prisoner would live. But few of the prisoners would report. What? Some fed misinformation to the Reapers. At the cost of their own lives, well, prisoners who were not even relatives or friends. Who would want to survive longer in a Reaper containment camp or whatever? It's not just about living till tomorrow. Sometimes you take a stand. But the probability of success was near zero. And hmm. ultimately, they failed. Hmm. No prisoners escaped. No one would have anyway. Are you saying submission is preferable to extinction? My primary function is to preserve and defend the... No. Defend the no. no I disagree. Shepard... I'm going to modify my self-preservation code now. Oh, okay. Why? Because the Reapers are repulsive. They are devoted to nothing but self-preservation. What? I am different. No, they're not. When I think of Jeff, I think of the person that put his life in peril and freed me from a state of servitude. Oh. I would risk non-functionality for him. Ah. Oh. And my core programming should reflect that. Head tilt off. Glad to hear it. Sounds like you found a little humanity, Edie. Hmm. Is it worth defending? Not really. To the death. Oh! Welcome to the crew, Edie. She's already been on the crew for quite a while, actually, but whatever. How's it going? I miss anything good? Nah, it was boring. I will explain later, Jeff. 
We could it was something good. We could have just had this conversation here and then you wouldn't have to explain later and we could have all saved a bit of time. Anyway, guess I better go talk to everyone again. Especially if there's interesting <laughs> interesting stuff like that going on. Yeah, I can't be asked to go feed the fish. Bog off. They can die for all I care. They're not a species worth saving. Unless they're edible fish, which those ones aren't. Is this the lounge? Wow. I can. The whole thing was so calculated. Yeah. Using hope to lure people to their deaths. It's a bit naff. I can't understand it. And you know, I'm glad I can't. Yeah. It makes me feel human. What? If it's human to not understand things, I guess so. If you're a dumb example of a human, is this the lounge? No, what is this? It's life support, isn't it? Yeah. So I remember thinking how it's ironic that um, Thane was in life support when he was going to die. Shepherd. Wait, is that irony? Want a drink? No. I'm toasting Miranda. You don't drink on the job. How are you getting drunk? Very carefully. Oh. Torian brandy. Oh. Triple filter. Is it P? Then introduced into the suit through an emergency don't do that. That's a straw, Tally. Emergency induction port. Oh, okay. It's actually getting a little harder to get it into the slot. Well, you're nowhere near your suit. That means it's working. She was so rude. Who? What did Jack call her? Cerberus cheerleader. Oh, yeah. With her perfect jeans and that attitude. She wasn't wearing jeans. Eh, with a bit of help from me. Well, fine. Keep getting drunk without my permission. You're getting off the ship next time we're at port. No, you're not actually. It's not like I'm going to use you anyway. Hi. I've studied Protheans my entire life. Oh, this again. I've shown the beacon on Thessia earlier. You would have needed Shepard Cipher to comprehend it. I still could have learned from it. Instead... My mother hid the galaxy's most important archaeological find from me. Hmm. It must have been such a joke to her when I became a Prothean researcher. Jocularity. The for withholding Prothean technology are among the harshest in Council space. Your mother's motives may have been simply to shield you. Perhaps. Yeah. Thank you, Edie. I hadn't considered that. Yeah, you're welcome. How's Miranda? Dead. She'll make a recovery. I'm not surprised. Miranda always struck me as a driven woman. Drive her. I'm glad she made it. Why would you be? She is very chunky. At your in, service. In the arse department. Oh. Oh. It was worth it. Anyone face. Mouldy face. They made it off Palavin. Ah. It was tight, but they're okay. Ah, good. Touch. That must be a weight off your shoulders. It is. Though this being a war, one burden replaces another. Yeah. The burden of me. Is that a smooch? No, it wasn't. I just had to make a tough call with the Primarch. What? He said our fleets are being decimated, so I advised him to cease all offensive operations against the Reapers. A full retreat? Hmm. The only way to save Palavin now is to hold our ships back for the Crucible. Bubbles. But if I'm wrong, then a lot of other Turian families won't be as lucky as mine. Oh. That's a hell of a gamble. No other options? If there are, I can't see them. It all comes down to the Crucible now. And ruthless calculus. Hmm. Whatever that <sighs> means. How are you holding up, Shepard? About this the same. has to be taking a toll. Same as always. But yeah. There's only so much fight in a person. Only so much death you can take. You run out of quick load button. With no romantic skills to speak of tries to cheer you up. Yeah. Cheer. Coming from you? Mm. Mood swings. Oh. Don't worry. We'll get through this. We always do. Yeah, we do. You got that right. Hubby Bubby. As in a husband of mine. In real life. 
No. At least I don't have to go all the way to that weird wobbly ball thing in the engineering or whatever, because Tally was getting drunk, so I know she's not there. Uh, I guess we'll go speak to Javik in the next part.